Now, does the fighting game player in you see how this duel is no different from a good read in a Smash game? You see how this is no different than walking up and F smashing? The dude's not even looking at the sky. You know why he's pulling out his molly? The molly's bad if you're not in Phoenix Ult, but because you're in Phoenix Ult, he expects this sky to not give us the duel because we're in Phoenix Ult. The duel is free for us. So we throw our molly to make her peek, but then we expect her to peek with flash. It's here, just all reads. It's a fighting game. Every duel is just a fighting game. It's just you're in neutral, and how do you get into the fight? The better Phoenix players get into the fights better. I actually called one of these plays for Box Box. Pull up that vibe one more time. We're going to end. Yeah, yeah let's here. just YOLO it. Pop Phoenix Ult and that. shift walk down C. Because they're going to be like, well, it's not C. And they're going to... Okay, so you already see I'm playing Phoenix for Box Box right now. Because I'm trying to teach him, right? So I noticed we've got Phoenix Ultimate. OD has the read that it's C. And so I'm like, well, what if we pop Phoenix Ult, but then shift walk? Yeah, because the enemy team, they're going to hear Phoenix ult go, it's not C. Well, let's push C because he's probably ulting out A or something, right? We're going to scale. Yeah, I'm down. Okay. I'll throw the normal smoke. But it, it doesn't stop out. here. Yeah, you watch this round. Second, so he ults and shift walks, okay, right, uh, yeah. okay, no which ends up, right, ends up working. So I'm a short. They've got a turret mode because we have the advantage in the fight. So do you see how an Ascendant 1 player can clap a Radiant level player when you have the read? You got the read. Oh, wow. It worked. Yeah. yeah. You see, he's like, oh, whoa, okay. Yeah. And now keep watching, keep watching. Uh, what the fuck? <laughs> keep watching. The short yeah. So he walks up Cubby. And I I'm basically just babysitting Box Box this whole game. Here's what I'm thinking. Because I want you to see how this game is played. I'm thinking Box Box is a League of Legends player. League of Legends players glance at their minimap every three seconds. I know because I was challenger in League of Legends. And so when I see him getting a cubby holding against this Radiant squad that's not scaling A because we're 3A, I know that Box Box is going to die looking at his minimap while he gets peaked. My charge going down. So watch. Though. I'm droning mid. I'm droning mid. Yeah, can you get close on the top box? The way? I think garage. Passing long. Nothing. And look at his eyes. You can see him doing it. Get close. Go look. You see, he just glanced at his minimap. He's blinking. Get your minimap box. Yeah. Stare this. at your crosshair and shoot them when they peek you. Yeah. How did I know he was looking at his minimap? I just know because I know him. I know how the player's thinking. I say, stop looking at your minimap box box. Just hold the angle and click when they peek you. Okay? It's like I'm in his head. Now keep watching. Yeah, I'm not sure. yeah. Yes, chef. He says, yes, chef. But you see, he can't help it. He's a goddamn League of Legends player. He just looked at his minimap anyways. Because he heard a fight. Watch. Oh, he's one. He's one. Oh, uh, 55 right, right, jet. 55 right, 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 right. jet. There was Eyebrows raised. Like, whoa. Whoa. This is why you're dying in your games. You're not ready for what's likely to happen. That's it. Fang's not ready to get re-peaked, so he's not holding the angle. Instead, he's swinging. Box Box, even with me in his ear saying, stay right there, hold, look at your crosshair. He can't do it. He can't resist. He's like, but I get, but, but there's noise. I have to look at my minimap. No, you have to, you have to control your space. This is not League of Legends. This is Valorant. Hello gamers, look at your elo. Now look at mine. Now back to your elo. Now back to mine. Sadly, it isn't mine. But if you stop autopiloting outdated strategies and start getting free VOD review coaching, it could look like it's mine. Look down. Back up. Where are you? You're on bind. With the strats your strats could be like. What's in your hand? Back at me. I have it. It's the Valorant gift card from Wuhujin. For your successful follow up thought, look again. The gift card is now an ego vandal. Anything is possible when you get your Valorant tips from a talking banana and not TikTok. I'm on a gaming chair. <laughs>got a really 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 tough note and i don't believe he's done it 80 percent of the vod needs to be at head height on a potential corner with a bit of a gap i stop counting it after he gets his first kill of each round so this includes pre-rounds there's no way you've done this this fast drop the vod we're engaging gamer mode. Hello. this counts man good luck so. eat healthy and i'll give it to you right after the buy what's up guys so right now it should be here Right now, it should be here. Happy Friday. Right now, it should be here. Yeah. Yeah. We're just doing no mercy. Yeah, because I want Fang to hit a mortal. And having 
perfect technique like this is like an infinite cheat code. It's not even funny. There's like a difference between somebody who's like trying to have good technique and somebody who does have good technique. And right now, Fang is trying to have good technique, which is good. That's the first step. It's the first step to having good technique. Yo, guess what's wrong? What's wrong is I told him he's to do this even in the pre-rounds. And I'm going to demonstrate so you can see the difference. Because I do have good technique. Yo, let's stop. No one gets past me again. Okay, that's me walking to showers. Let's watch Fang walk to showers again. What's up, guys? Hey, Fang. You can What's even up, see hey, here he's he's using W and A, which I did not. I used just A. However, technically, I didn't tell him to focus on that. You think everyone should do this? No, I think Fang should do this because it's in Fang's notes. But do you see the difference between trying and like succeeding? I'm just trying oh, to show yeah. you what we're looking for. Yeah, it's yeah. like n perfectionist level. Steve. What is a head? See, he's trying. He's thinking about what it is still. A one tap? I want you coming when it's subconscious. L let me make it like really clear. When I give you notes like this, everybody, when I give anybody notes, I want you coming back when you think you've met all the notes, as in you don't have to think about them and it's in your gameplay. So if I say your technique's bad, then I want you bringing me a VOD where your technique's good and you didn't even have to think about it because you really focus on the technique the whole time. Okay? But you don't even have to think about it because it just comes naturally now because you focus on it so much. No. First of all, you're aiming at head height for this pillar. I can tell. You should be able to tell too because head height for this back wall is like here. So you're aiming for close wall you goober and this is too close if they were to peek you their head like if they're to peek close wall their head's gonna come out like here on a ferrari and they will ferrari you here you're in like kind of an off angle one sec i just gotta walk octagon okay so if they're gonna peek you close so you're aiming up at close wall it's a lot easier to hit this shot on the guy who's slow peeking around like a noob. It's way easier to do that than it is to hit this shot on the guy who's fast peeking you. And that's because the guy who's fast peeking you won't stop moving and your crosshair is going to trail behind them the whole time. The guy who's slow peeking you will literally, your crosshair is going to intercept them. Because if they keep moving, your crosshair moves into them. Easy shot. If they stop moving, well, then they're right here. And if they keep moving back away, well, then they're behind the wall. You don't have to track them. So all we're trying to do is avoid that tracking scenario where you lag behind them the entire time. You know what I'm talking about? Everyone's done this. You've gotten like wide swung and you've gone to track them and you keep going behind and behind and behind and you die. So the crosshair needs to be wider here so that that doesn't happen. And if you're expecting the close angle, I'll hold like even like this wide. If they come close, it's an easy adjustment. But they come wide. You want to be able to hit them before they get past your crosshair. So we're way too tight. That's true. There you go. You just got dinked for 145. And then they, they shot you in the body and you died. There could be a guy there. You would even jump spot since you got a specter. I'd be down not to give them that. And then you could come out wide. I'm down. Brandon right might lurk up on you. I, I didn't own. Okay, okay, okay. Correct me if I'm wrong, Fang. But I think this is your current mental model for how you're going to get a kill without using ability. You're thinking, I need like some off angle or I need to catch them off guard. Correct me if I'm wrong. I think that's what you're trying to think about right now. You're thinking, how am I going to be sneaky and get a kill thanks to my sneakiness? Because I can't use abilities. Is that what you're thinking? It just looks like you're trying to like be sneaky. Wait, huh? What, were you all tabbed, Fang? Do, do I need to ask my question again? Or are you just thinking about it? You got interrupted at work? SMH, job things. Are you good to go? I got all day. I'm patient. Fully attentive? It's lit. Don't even worry, Fang. I literally do not mind. Everybody has obligations in life and Valorant's just a video game. Don't even sweat it. Okay. So I was asking, I made an observation 
that it looks like you're thinking a lot about trying to get tricky. Uh, because you're not allowed to use abilities, the way it looks like you're trying to play is you're trying to get like some off angle, some shock factor, some surprising like engagement on the enemies to get your kill. Am I correct? Like it seems like you're really thinking about how you're gonna get tricky oh, and get your tricky kill. Full on cheeser mode. Perfect. Perfect. It's a crutch. Let me explain. Do you think I need to be on cheeser mode to get the first kill in your lobby? What I'm asking, what do you think my odds are if I take this straight up duel A short in your lobby? What odds are you giving me if I just hunt that duel with equal guns? 80, 20, I'm not that good. No, I wish. 55, 45, that's probably closer. It's probably like 60, 40. Point is, it's better than 50, 50. Isn't it still 50, 50? You think I'm 50, 50 against a guy who moves and aims like this? Nah, <laughs> nah. I am like 55 or 60, okay? Against Fang? Yeah, because we're in Fang's lobby. You know who Fang is against? He's against other Fangs. Skill-based matchmaking. Yeah, actually, Pen Flash is right around Fang's rank. Um, Let me pull up the TDM. So Pen Flash is Ascendant 1, just like Fang is right around there. And I play some TDMs to warm up. Here's Pen Flash. Yeah, 6 and 2. 75, 25. I I've got an edge, a big edge on players of this ELO. Now, Fang already establishing a bit of that edge, but he's playing too smart. You're playing too smart, Fang. I don't want you to crutch on some sneaky angle to get the kill. I don't want you to kill them because they're not looking at you or because you're a tricky off angle. I need to kill them because you're literally just more prepared for the fight than these hecking Ascendant 1 noobs because they're crossers all over the place. But the first kill of the round to be high ego. And then you play smart rest of the round. Okay. First kill should be like, I got my sheriff. They got their sheriff. I'm going to peak showers and fight them and kill them. It's not about I'm going to be tricky in this off angle and get my advantage. I'm going to be tricky here. I'm going to swing off of my buddy's trap. No, no, you're going to fucking kill them. And your litmus test for when you're done is when you are killing them. The util is like so absurdly powerful in this game, Fang, but you know what else is powerful? Gunfights. Box Box is Ascendant, okay? We pulled him in. I don't know if you watched the Box Box coaching segment, but I brought him in to High Immortal, Low Radiant lobbies, and holy, he got wiped in the 50s, okay? He felt so absurdly humbled, and you would see it if you looked at his like POV, and it's because of the technique. There's no secret that Tempo has that you can't have, Fang. It only takes, I'm not even shitting you, like a month. And you already have the raw aim. It, it might sound unbelievable to you, but you have nearly equal raw aim to Tempo. You don't have his confidence. You don't have his movement. And you don't have his crosshair placement. And that's what I need you to develop. Nice. Look how you walk through U-Haul. Okay. One enemy remaining. Nice. We don't need to clear this. But also, your crosshair is like shaky. I'm booting up behind again. I'm going to walk through U-Haul. It's like in Smash, if you have high tech skill, but you have no confidence and you just play really passive. Have you seen that video where Mango just styles on the audience and they keep having audience members come up and play against Mango? The classic? Perfect. That's literally what Diamond Elo is. It's like a litmus test for do you have the max? Here's how I'm coming into you. I'm not clearing that other corner because my raise is in front of me. But you'll notice when you come into you, notice how my crosshair's laser on this edge. Your crosshair floats over here and it's really shaky. L watch. One enemy remaining. Nice. Two Good flicks. Nice, for sure. The reason why we're focusing on this now is because we're just trying to get straight to Immortal. Invented by my father, George Washington Offang. It's a hey, holy shit. Did you say George Washington off angle? Wait, Fuki off angle. I fucking knew it. I knew you, it, you tricky trickster. Invented by my father, George Washington Offang. No, just kill them. You want to see my off angle? This is my off angle. Invented by fucking talking banana. Bam! It's a good fight for Spectre. If they start using util to flush me out, I'll hop over here, I'll break the util, and then I'll try, I'll try and fight. So, um, boop, 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 Jeef the Thief, that's not in his notes. You're playing Phoenix, not Reyna, man? Yeah, you're playing better Reyna. Phoenix is literally better Reyna, because you know what happens after you get this kill, and you hop over here? If they're pushing you, they're freaking all blind, and they're all dead. Or you throw this molly now, 
They can't push you. You flash them off of holding it, then you walk up and you flash and they're all dead. So it was in your notes, you thought? No. It's something I pointed out during your last VOD. I didn't write it down, no? And how to use off angles to your advantage. Crosshair placement, arc, all aim, vertical movement. No abilities until you get one kill. Ah, oh, fuck me, dude. Let me let me retype this. My fault. It wasn't clear. My fault. My fault. My fault. My fault. My fault. Me. Me. Not Fang. My fault. 100%. Do, do, do. So, you see how after I get this kill, I hold W or I hold left click and I'm like backing up here. And now this is what I'm talking about. Like this. Now, if they're trying to chase into you, you hold from your off angle. Okay. If they're trying, if they're chilling a bit, you use the molly. You use your util. Me. G1 who zero. Oh man, dude. Let, let me give you some angles real quick that I would like to see you play. I am pissed. I just wasted Fang's time because I worded something poorly. It's literally my bad. Okay. Let's say they're pushing A. And you start showers because I would like you to start showers. And I like that you did. So I wouldn't ask for the smoke. I'd pick like this. Take your fight. They're not here. You take your orb. They're coming A short. I'm looking for this type of play. Like you're just hunting them. Bam. You take your fight. Bam. Bam. Good movement. Good technique. You take your fight. Then you play util, tricky, off angles, everything. Swing this fucking... Yes! Uh, raises? Perfect, Fang. Literally perfect. Now imagine if your crosshair was at head height and you did 78 damage here. Do you know what that is? You know what we call that in the biz? Call that one and a, and a half, Fang. You know why you shot this race's body? Because the moment you got that kill, your brain was like, how can I use my util? Don't lie. Your brain was like, util time, baby. No, shut up. Time and place, Fang. You don't have time for util. Why are you pre-aiming to swing her? Foxbox made this mistake actually yesterday and I'm going to show you because this is, you literally made the same mistake as him and it's actually really, really, really topical. Oh yeah, here it is. Okay. Yeah. They double smoked. Wait they for the it. start. Wait for the start. Then you okay. can fight. Landing soon. There it is. Okay. POV, you're literally about to hit your Twitter clip because Woohoo Jin's your teammate. I need you to watch this. This is, this is so important. Let's ignore the part where he cashes out on one. Okay, that's fine. We're going to ignore that. What's important is what Foxbox does after he kills one and what Fang does and what Fombless does and what everybody watching this does if you're below Immortal. You all do this and you need to fix this. Watch. Okay, we kill one. Now what? What does the Radiant do? The Radiant walks left. They unswing because the goons are looking at us. And we're going to try and hold from an off angle. We're not going to tuck. No, tucking's really passive. We're probably going to line up these two lines in case Omen TP Chen. And we're going to hold from an off angle to try and get the next kill. And from that off angle, when we take our shot, we'll be walking left to tuck. Yes. So the idea is we can just make this up arbitrarily. We pretend we got the kill here. Okay. We'll come here and we'll hold this next guy. Shoot and tuck for the flash. Okay. Then we flash after the second set of shots. So we kill this guy. We don't peek. We come over here. We hold. They peek us. We shoot. And we tuck. We pull the flash. That second set of bullets is really important. That's what all of the radiant cracked ass phoenixes are doing. Watch what box box does after he gets his kill. Peaks. And sure enough, I was right. The omen did TP back Jen. Oops. But what he shouldn't be doing is backing up and pulling his flash out either. He should just be backing up to take the next gunfight, expecting them to swing him. Watch Fang's VOD. Watch what he does after he kills Reyna. Watch. Freeze. What am I doing? Here, holding from my off angle, maybe even crouching. Tapping her head and then tucking to play util if I'm still alive. Okay? Watch. You see how you subconsciously pre-aimed and started swinging? You can't help it. It's in your muscle memory. You're like, who's next? No, 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 no. They're going to peek you. If your crosshair was just right where I'd put mine, this assiduousness, this like crackedness is what Fang is missing. He's missing like the him energy, the reads. You're missing like the correct way to take the fight. 
Y you know what you're doing, Fang? You're hecking F smashing and then dodge rolling all game. That's how you take these fights. You're a noob. You've got a hecking wave dash to reposition and wait for them to roll. Because they're going to roll right into you because everyone rolls right into you. And unfortunately, as a Phoenix player, this is the muscle you really need. Yes! Sit the f*** down! Look how bad these guys are! Why aren't you swinging this guy with more confidence? One A short. Heal! One tap. We're just double showers. You need to be faster, Fang. I don't want to watch your VOD and be able to easily guess Platinum in Guess the Rank. A cracked Phoenix, after they kill this Reyna, is knife out, hopping over here, without a thought, sitting in their molly, maybe walling, but they're looking at their map, thinking, then they're coming back over here, maybe jump spotting, and bam, they're back in the action. Or maybe coming out here to fight with their team. Back in the action. Let me pull up a heckin' Phoenix VOD. Pro Phoenix, you know what? I'm down. I'm actually down. This is a rare exception. No, I am okay. actually down for this guy right now. This guy's actually the god of finessing fights. Oh my god, he's so good. Look, he got his one and a half. Bam! All this guy does is get his one and a half. Look, did you see him heckin' like... About his flash? God, no. Look. All I want you to look at is a this. <laughs> Smash replace Ares all day. Oh, he, this dude autopilots Giga. But it's actually fine here because the way he takes his fights is good. Damn, why has he got swag with it? This is what I'm talking about. Trying to reposition. Bam. They're never pushing B. I really want a round where they push him. Like these retake things are like, it's nonsense. Holy fuck. He plays A retake nine rounds in a row or what? <laughs> There's no shot, right? Looking for a single round where they push him. Thank you. Oh, well, great. They're not pushing us. 12 A retakes. Are you kidding me? Are you kidding me right now? Zoms eight months ago. I mean, it's so old, but like, <laughs> no shot, right? There's no way it's a retake every round. Thank you. Bang, this is literally exactly what I explained. Do you see? Do you see? Yeah, he's got to play over here because he's a boom bot. You see, he's just taking the fight and look what he does after he gets the first kill. Because you were out here like, but I'm Phoenix. He just holds the spray button. The swaps a pistol, but now his raise nade's coming through, so he's lit. And he has time to molly. Nice. Look, look, look right there. Okay, okay, okay. So he thought they were long. Which is why he was not ready for this guy here. Okay. But watch what he does the moment he sees this guy. Look where we're walking now. You see? Look how assiduous. Now we've got a reload. No problem. No problem. And now we're playing Flash to punish the dumb players who will just F smash and roll right into us. That's what Phoenix Util is for. Phoenix Util doesn't get kills at a pro level you know why because the gauge is one dimensional nobody picks this guy in pro play really he's not picked in pro games because you know what people don't do in pro games they don't roll into you in f smash it's all smash references yeah because he's a smash player when i coached rag it was all parry game references because he plays parry games i coached box boxes league of legends references because he plays league of legends Now, does the fighting game player in you see how this duel is no different from a good read in a Smash game? You see how this is no different than walking up and F-smashing? The dude's not even looking at the sky. 
You know why he's pulling out his molly? The molly's bad if you're not in Phoenix Ult. But because you're in Phoenix Ult, he expects this guy to not give us the duel. Because we're in Phoenix Ult. The duel is free for us. So we throw our molly to make her peek. But then we expect her to peek with flash. It's here, just all reads. It's a fighting game. Every duel is just a fighting game. It's just you're in neutral and how do you get into the fight? The better Phoenix players get into the fights better. I actually called one of these plays for box box. Pull up that VOD one more time. And we're going to end. Yeah, yeah let's here. just YOLO it. Pop Phoenix ult and shift walk down C because they're going to be like, well, it's not C. And they're going to. Okay, so you already see I'm playing Phoenix for box box right now because I'm trying to teach him, right? So I noticed we've got Phoenix ultimate. OD has the read that it's C. And so I'm like, well, what if we pop Phoenix ult? But then shift walk. Yeah, because the enemy team, they're going to hear Phoenix ult go. It's not C. Well, let's push C because he's probably ulting out A or something. Right. We're going to scale. Yeah, I'm down. Okay. I'll throw the normal smoke. But it, it doesn't down. stop here. Down. You watch this round. Second, so he ults and shift okay, walks. Right, uh, yeah. Okay, there's no turret. Which ends up working. I'm fucking a short. They've got a turret. Because we have the advantage in the fight. So do you see how an ascendant one player can clap a radiant level player when you have the read? You got the read. Oh, wow, it works. Yeah. He's like, oh, whoa, okay. Yeah. <laughs> but now keep watching, keep watching. Yeah, what the fuck? <laughs> keep watching. The yeah. So he walks up Cubby. And I I'm basically just babysitting box box this whole game. Here's what I'm thinking. Because I want you to see how this game is played. I'm thinking box box is a League of Legends player. League of Legends players glance at their minimap every three seconds. I know because I was challenger in League of Legends. And so when I see him getting a cubby holding against this Radiant squad that's not scaling A because we're 3A, I know that Box Box is going to die looking at his minimap while he gets peaked. My charge going down. So watch. I'm droning mid. I'm droning mid. Okay. Can you get close on the top box? Somebody? I think Garage. Passing long. Nothing. And look at his eyes. You can see him doing it. Get close. Don't look. You see, he just glanced at his minimap. He's blinking. Get your minimap, Box Box. Stare at your crosshair and shoot them when they peek you. Okay. How did I know he was looking at his minimap? I just know because I know him. I know how the player's thinking. I say, stop looking at your minimap box box. Just hold the angle and click when they peek you. Okay? It's like I'm in his head. Now keep watching. Yeah, I'm gonna gonna sure. yeah. Yes, chef. He says, yes, chef. But you see, he can't help it. He's a goddamn League of Legends player. He just looked at his minimap anyways. Because he heard a fight. Watch. Oh, he's one. He's one. Oh, uh, 55 right, 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 jet. 55 right, right, right. jet. There was one. Eyebrows raised. Like, whoa. Whoa. This is why you're dying in your games. You're not ready for what's likely to happen. That's it. Fang's not ready to get re-peaked, so he's not holding the angle. Instead, he's swinging. Box Box, even with me in his ear saying, stay right there, hold, look at your crosshair. He can't do it. He can't resist. He's like, but I get, but, but there's noise. I have to look at my minimap. No, you have to, you have to control your space. This is not League of Legends. This is Valorant. One minute. You see, look how many shots he had on these guys. You know why he had this many shots? Because these guys suck. There's shocks that he's here too. Box box would have been good for three this round with his ascendant one aim against these radiants. Okay? You're worrying too much about everything. You have to just be thinking about the duels and how you're going to fight them. Don't worry about off angles. Kill the first guy and then think, That's how's the next sweet. guy going to push me? And they're probably just going to sprint right at you. And so punish them for that. As long as your answer to killing them isn't to sprint right at them, you're pogging off your goal. The floor. Moopy schmoopy. What is up with these bodies going? Yeah. <laughs> bodies everywhere, Fang. Bodies everywhere. To reiterate and be perfectly clear, high ego to hunt the first duel. Try to avoid swinging more than one enemy. Sometimes this means holding an angle. Yes. After the first duel, do anything that isn't swing them because they will almost always swing you. <laughs> that makes sense, Fang? Like, they're just going to roll into you. Everyone just does this. Like, they always just roll into you. It's so predictable. You can punish this and, like, cruise up to Immortal. Like, nobody's playing the game correctly.